What's up, what's going on guys? Captain Monk here again with another gameplay commentary. But before I get into the gameplay guys, I'm first gonna say that, you know, I've noticed lately, you know, on my videos, you know, my you, my like dislike video show is usually quite decent. It's pretty good. But there's always that one dislike and stuff, and I just wanna let you guys know, it doesn't bother me to dislike my videos, it really doesn't. But if you're gonna dislike the video, I it'd make my day if you just let me know why so I can improve. That's what I'm here for. I'm trying to make these videos as good as I can, and if I can make improvements I could, you know, I could go some of this. I mean, seriously. I mean, seriously, guys. If I were to get the world see in my videos, I mean, if I'm gonna do that, I need to get, make top-notch videos, guys. I really want to make the best videos I possibly can, and I need you guys' help to do that. I mean, if you guys tell me this video sucks, I don't like it. Tell me why you don't like it. The quality. I'm trying my best, guys, to fix this. A friend of mine's coming back to town. He's been away for three weeks. He went to get back. He's gonna help me fix Sony Vegas because. Fail there. I can't really seem to get my um. Can't get Sony Vegas working right now. I don't know why it's just not working. I think it's because the trial expired. I may not. I may be wrong. I don't know. I'm kind of. I don't understand this crap to be honest, guys. But seriously, guys, I want the. I want people to see my videos. I really do. But people aren't going to see these crap ass videos that I'm making right now. So I need you guys' help. If you guys give me tips and stuff and just say, you know, this is what you need to do better. Don't tell me that. Like this video sucks. Like I said earlier, like that doesn't help me. Tell me why. Tell me what I need to do to improve these videos, guys. Cause I really want to get somewhere with this. I really want people to see my videos. It, it'd mean the world to me, guys, if you did that. But enough about that. Let's talk about the gameplay a little bit here. I'm using the command with the dual mag. I'm using blackjack and slide attack mask. Again, my usual setup. I always use this setup because it is my the best in my opinion. And it suits the assault rifle role the best in my opinion. You don't have to agree with me, guys. It's my opinion. Now, in this gameplay, I do go 35 and 1. It's a great gameplay. I think I'm going on a humongous kill streak. I end up running out of ammo with my commando, so I end up picking a stoner up later. I think I just got shooting stoner I can pick up later, anyways. But it's, it's a great gameplay, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy just watching this gameplay. But yeah, guys, when using the commando, I like to compare it a lot to the, um, what's it called? The AK 47, because they're very similar. They don't look the same at all, but they're very similar in the sense that they both have the same damage and the same rate of fire and the same um, magazine size. I would like to c compare the Commando more to the Galil, but the Galil's got larger mag size and a slower reload, so. But the thing that makes the Commando and the AK not similar though is the Commando is a more of a long range weapon in my opinion. You don't have to agree with me guys, but I think it's better long range because it has light recoil, but it's it's honestly it's pretty clear. And it's it's just it's very easy to use at long range because it's so it, so easy to handle. Whereas the AK-47, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying it's hard to handle, but it, it's easier to use at closer range because its iron sight kind of kind of goes out of control if it makes sense. I mean, it's in control, but it's hard to stay on target if that makes sense. If you know what I mean, you never use the gun. If you know what I mean, you've used the gun. It's that simple. The gun kind of is hard to see what you're shooting at once you start shooting. So once you start shooting, it's kind of spraying for if that makes sense. You just, you just pray for the kill. And you're going to pick up the stone here. And this is not a bad setup, guys. I may end up, when I post my stoner video up, I may end up using the setup. It's not a bad setup at all. But I'll probably roll stay in mags instead. Except mags and red knots. I don't like Warlord. I don't like it very much. But anyways, guys. This is a great gameplay. I think I called my dogs in. Let's go, actually. But yeah, stone is pretty powerful gun as well. So, keep that in mind. But I think the only reason I end up dying in this game is because I ran into this thing. And my friend, he was using a care package. And he gets a crate. He's like, so wait, you're out of ammo? Hey, I got an ammo crate. Come over here and take this ammo crate. I was like, sweet, awesome. I roll over there and I get killed, so. I mean, actually, I get killed right after getting the ammo crate to come think of it. I don't get killed because I got the ammo crate, but. If I were to stay in this building with ammo, I probably would have lived the entire game, honestly. This building is the best if you've got motion sensor or something. I don't think I had my planted, but we had a blackbird, so it worked out just fine. It's constant blackbird It's good. good game. I love this. It was good. Yeah, guys, I really want to talk about more about the gun, but to be honest, I mean, assault rifles are easy mode in this game, and once I, I'm kind of excited to cover these assault rifles because they're easy to get gameplays with, so I'm constantly just throwing them at you guys because it's so easy to do. I'm really eager to use the shotguns. You know, let's talk about the shotguns because I started talking about this in my AK video, but I haven't finished up with that. But the release in the Olympia is so bad. It's because its damage sucks, but it's the exact same, like, capacity as all the other double barrel sh sort of shotguns in the other games. And if this gun had like a 50-30 damage, that's all it needs. 50-30 is great. 
That's all I needed. But they didn't do it. I don't know why. But if they gave the Olympia 50-30 damage, the Olympia would probably be the best shot, honestly. It, in the stake. Yeah, not in the stake. Sorry, right, the stack well. Anyways, guys, this gameplay is coming to a close pretty quickly here. But, yeah, guys, before this... I want, if you guys like the video, go ahead and give it a like. If you disliked it, just consider maybe, you know, if you guys really don't dislike it, let me know how I can improve. But if you're just disliking it just to bring me down, you're not succeeding. I'm still here. Anyways, guys, if, if you really liked it, go ahead and give it a favorite. And um, subscribe to my channel if you like the videos I'm bringing. See you guys later. Bye-bye.